These sanctions just always impress me among other problems of just being sadistic. In fact, I can't think of any example in history where a country actually gave in to sanctions and said, okay, we're going to stop doing you know, whatever the hegemon doesn't want us to do. In, in general, they just hunker down and they, don't, uh, they yeah. don't change their ways, either for good or bad. Matter of fact, I think it does the opposite. So if you have dissenters in Iran... Uh, and then you put on sanctions, people, by their very nature, unify. You know, if we're attacked by foreigners and, uh, and, and you know, have a 9-11, you know, Republicans and Democrats come together because we see it as a foreign source. So this undermines the dissidents in, in these countries. But the two areas, as a matter of fact, the neocons claim the sanctions have done this wonderful good because that is what brought them to the table. Yet at the same time, many neocons say, we don't even want to talk to them. But... Uh, I don't. I don't believe that they do achieve uh, anything. I mean, if if ISIS can uh, get the oil out of the ground, package it up, and sell it, and get millions of dollars to run their uh, run their so-called uh, quasi government and fight these wars, I mean, uh, how the sanctions don't seem to be, you know, uh, may, uh, you know, a tremendous success. Also, they uh, have always used South Africa as as an example where sanctions made the difference. But I think there are some uh, geopolitical and social social uh, changes that occur there that made that come about. But they won't give up. Uh, they have to feel good about it. I was always uh, annoyed with it in Congress because we had an anti-war unofficial group, uh, the few libertarian Republicans, and then uh, generally the Black Caucus and other others did not. Uh, they're, they're really against war because they want all that money to go to food stamps for people here. But when it when it came to sanctions, it was they just could never vote against sanctions because that would prevent war. And uh, they 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 wanted to look tough and they would go along with it. And they'd go along with the sanctions, uh, but uh, never get the results that they thought they were going to get. Ron, there are uh, all kinds of inter interesting things happening as usual with the uh, international monetary questions. We had the Swiss. Uh,